Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Oh my god, look at my skin. <laughs> It's getting worse and worse every day, guys. Dengan janggutnya, misainya, tak potong lagi. But that's not the point for today's video. Hari ni aku nak share dengan korang my experience when it comes to my hair. Let me just like undur sikit. Okay. Um, when I was a lot younger, I think that my confidence tu datang daripada rambut instead of like the other parts of my body because as you can see that I am not good looking and then I am not skinny I don't have muscle so one thing yang buatkan aku rasa macam a little bit confident adalah my hair but unfortunately uh, my hair is getting worse and worse and worse every day dia dah start jarang and everything so I'm not comfortable with it I think that I'm still young and having macam a problem with hair is actually quite disappointing lah kalau nak cerita zaman macam uh, umur 20-an, awal-awal 20 kan I was super confident myself sebab rambut aku macam bagus Whenever aku pergi salon ke apa, people would compliment my hair Cakap ya yeah, healthy, dia bagus But now, it's not So, I don't know how to say this Bila my hair started getting worse Dia dah start kugu and everything I rasa macam tak boleh nak keluar rumah Without wearing anything to cover it up especially kalau nak pergi hang out with friends ke ataupun you know even nak pergi beli makan untuk myself pun I rasa macam a little bit awkward and I rasa macam ada orang tengok and kutuk like my condition you know so yeah that's why a couple of years back aku started pakai topi I do have like a lot of topi right now I akan keluar pakai topi kalau korang tengok my Instagram photos every photos memang akan ada pakai cap aku dah try a lot of things untuk buatkan dia jadi baik balik banyak produk dah cuba tapi dia macam tak membaik sepenuhnya kan dia masih lagi gugur masih lagi jarang tak boleh nak buat apa aku dah cuba banyak benda Kecuali benda-benda yang mahal lah Contohnya macam tanam rambut ke apa kan It's not gonna happen lah Because I am a broke bitch Nice I cannot buy Ataupun afford that kind of stuff So that's why aku nak kena terima je Rambut aku makin gugur Aku dah start botakkan rambut For like 2 years Lebih dah Tapi Sampai sekarang pun masih tak comfortable Masih lagi rasa macam Tak boleh nak sesuaikan diri But Yeah I don't know what to say Tapi kalau korang tengok rambut aku sekarang ni Dia macam dah start panjang balik I am going to cut it Tapi the problem here sekarang ni adalah Dekat tempat aku tak ada kedai yang buka PKP lockdown ni macam orang masih lagi Belum bersedia untuk buka kedai Gunti rambut I don't know why So I was thinking that I need to get myself Like a machine untuk botakkan sendiri Okay guys, so I finally got it. Aku dah beli dah mesin yang untuk potong rambut tu. And harga dia agak pricey sebenarnya. Aku rasa dia RM86.90. Kalau kita tengok dekat kedai tu memang ada beberapa jenis dan beberapa uh, harga lah yang berbeza which is RM20, RM30. Tapi I, I decided untuk dapatkan yang ni sebab dia ada like a lot of thing here. Ini empat ni adalah untuk macam ukuran berapa pendek atau berapa panjang yang kita nak kan So normally I would go for macam yang kedua punya I'm not sure which one nanti kita akan check Sebab I don't really want it to be like really short yang macam botak-botak tak ada rambut I still nak ada rambut tu sikit So I would use nombor dua Normally lah kalau aku pergi kedai untuk gunting rambut aku akan cakap nombor dua So yeah this is how it looks like this Nanti aku buka untuk korang tengok Senang ni dia ada bagi uh, Kertas yang memang tidak akan dibaca The machine itself Yang ni wired tau Ada yang jenis macam Pakai bateri uh, Tapi yang tu aku macam tak suka sangat Sebab dia macam tak power sangat Kalau kita pakai bateri So Ini rupa dia Sikat <laughs> Untuk sikat rambut ni Si rambut aku memang Tengok ada a lot of space dekat atas tu Macam pokok pinus kau tahu tak And then Benda ni Nanti aku akan cuba And kita akan <laughs> Kita akan buat hari ni Oh my god This is so scary Sebab aku tak tahu sama ada aku boleh buat ke tak And if something Goes wrong <laughs> I don't know what to do So kita akan cuba Botakkan kepala aku hari ni Okay Guys Okay, wait, 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 wait. Okay, mind that. Sorry. Yep. Okay. 
guys so aku ada this one and this one as well to tengok I did it Two thousand years later. Dengan harga lapan puluh ringgit, I don't think it's worth it. Aku rasa kan kalau ada bubble <laughs> yang tengok video aku ni, aku rasa macam mesti dia macam kau buat apa bodoh, kan? Tapi we are going to do this PKP style. Stop it. Get some help. Aku rasa disaster guys, disaster Macam mana aku nak good, aku nak potong yang belakang punya Oh my god <laughs> So guys, this is like the final result as you can see I think I did like a pretty good job, it's not too shabby And yeah i look like a watermelon but it's okay it's fine because this is how it's gonna be and for you guys i just want to say thank you so much for watching this video dia tak adalah video yang fancy ke tak adalah video yang macam best sangat pun but this is me um trying to share my experience guna machine for the first time untuk cut my hair during this pkp lockdown sebab tak ada kedai buka kan so yeah thank you so much for watching uh see you guys in the next video i guess bye